friends don't lie. lie. It's not working. We'll have to try later. It's making my head hurt. So it is working. <laughs> I don't have 11 powers. It's me, Brittany, AKA Fine Apple Vegan, and these is my children. Today we are reviewing some vegan donuts. Who better to have in the video to try the donuts? Like, I can't eat all these than my kids. So we are gonna try these bomb looking donuts from Karen, AKA Follow the White Rabbit Vegan Cuisine. And let's start with Lizzie. Hmm, I guess we can all try some of each one. How about that? Yeah. Hmm. Let me grab a knife. I see you on the first piece. Mmm. That frosting's good. Yes. Okay, here you go. All right, ready? Let's go. Mmm. Oh, that's mm. good. Oh. Mmm. Mm. I didn't get enough pretzel. He doesn't like anything. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. So this is going to be interesting because I don't like black licorice. Mm. Oh, they're mm. frosty. I love Ooh. that one. Mm -hmm. This one is covered in frosting. That's why oh, I love it. yeah. What's that slime? Oh, it's yeah. just frosting. It's, it's like decorative frosting. Ooh, it looks creative. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's those goo from the um, ghost. ghost it smells like pancakes. It smells like pancakes? Mm -hmm. It does, actually, a little bit. It's oh. donuts. Jeez, you already tried yes, it. Really? I guess we're trying it. Okay, so we're going to try the Ghostbuster one. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh. Okay, so let's do Frankenstein. It looks kind of stained on the... Hair. It looks like the hair is kind of it's look, It looks like ground up um, cookies. Yeah, can I have it's a piece Oreos. of the hair? I want some can, I have, can I have some of the green? So that one's kind of falling apart at this point. Too much sauce. Hold it. Hold it. Oh, so y'all, this is my fault because we should have did this video when I got them yesterday. Jay. <laughs> Jace, I guess y'all can go ahead and start because Jace went ahead and started. Mm. Mm. I'm sorry, it can't stop. Mm. 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 Um, Carrie, so I'm sorry for waiting one day, but they still good. Ooh. They're still good, girl. Mm. Okay, mm -hmm. try some of that. And y'all, she's in the same town as me. <laughs> That never happens because there's no vegan stuff where I live. So yeah, we're gonna be ordering a lot of birthday donuts and holiday donuts and all the donut kebabs and donut sandwiches and donut soup and what? donut. Little Spidey. Little Spidey, I'm gonna call him mm. Benjamin Franklin. He's kind of soft, so. Oh, we can actually cut through him. That's messed up. <laughs> that is messed up. Um, I didn't mean Are to you supposed to be vegan? I am vegan. <laughs> So do, why do you do that? Cookie spiders don't count. Cookie spider lives matter. You, you said that's the first best? So if all of you guys had to pick your favorite one, which one would it have been? Mine would be the Ghostbuster. This Ghostbuster, one? yours is the spider one? Yours is the one with the eyes? Which one do you think is best? I don't know. You can't Tied. pick? The ones with the eyes and Ghostbusters are tied. You know so funny? My favorite one is the salted caramel one with the pretzels on it. That's my favorite one. So this is just one of our local loves that we are celebrating today. And if you guys haven't already gotten her name, it is Follow the White Rabbit Vegan Cuisine. Her handle is gonna be somewhere here, at Follow the White Rabbit Vegan Cuisine. Her name is Carrie and she is so sweet. You guys definitely should order some donuts. And they're not basic boring donuts, but she can do the regular glazed donuts some sprinkles, holiday, a lot of festive donuts, but they are so delicious. Even a day late, I'm sorry. It was my fault, but they were still bomb, and I loved them, and my kids loved them. 
So yes, let's see what's up next for our local love. If you haven't already, go ahead Save and subscribe to my channel. Save the turtles. Hey guys, welcome back. And for our second local love, we have ice cream by AJ Scoops. And she is a local vegan ice cream, I guess, chef. And when I say that, it's because she creates some of the best plant-based ice cream. She uses a mix of soy milk, um, coconut milk, almond milk, depending on the flavor. And today we have my favorite flavor from her. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell y'all the truth. I've already had it, okay? But it is so good, but my kids have not had it. So I'm gonna have them taste this one as well. And it is called Cookie Monster, okay? Y'all, this ice cream, and I'm never, I've never been the type of person that likes the colorful ice cream because it just looks like it's too sweet. But the balance of sweetness and cookies and deliciousness in this ice cream, I just can't even explain it. And I really hope my kids can explain it for you guys because yeah, it's really good. <laughs> All right, you guys, so this is the Cookie Monster Ice Cream by AJ Scoops. It is soy based um, and it is colored with spirulina and it has vegan Oreos in it and chocolate chip cookies and y'all, it is bomb. So let me go ahead and scoop some out for each of you guys. It looks like the smurf went through a lawnmower, but. It's okay. Jay said it's okay. Sometimes I eat smurf also. Okay, so let's start. My favorite, I'm so mad I only have a little bit. You can share with me. It's okay, baby. I want y'all to have some, because I've had it before. Cookie Monster. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is so good. Tastes like Cookie Monster. It's so good. Tastes like the Cookie Monster. <laughs> How do you know it tastes like that? Have you tried one? Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm trying mm -hmm. it right now. Yeah, you know, this is really good. Better than I remember. Cookie monster. I'm gonna tell you a story about how good this is. Where she serves her ice cream sometimes, my husband works down the street. So he was trying to surprise me one day and he went by to get me some. The place is about 45 minutes from my house and he never planned on doing it. So we, he didn't have a cooler or anything. By the time he got to me, it was a puddle. Most time, you know, you get melted ice cream, throw it away, right? No, I drank it. So it was a milkshake by that point, but I drank it, it was so good. You guys, you definitely have to hit up AJ Scoops and hire her to cater. She does like catering events, birthday parties, a lot of things, and I don't feel like it's ever too cold for ice cream. Even when it gets cool outside, it's warm inside, y'all. Like, it's never too cold for ice cream, in my opinion. But this is my favorite flavor of ice cream, like, currently. And it's probably gonna be for mm. a very long time. So I definitely think you guys should hit her up and check out her flavors, because she has so many more flavors. Like, I've tried her butter pecan, she has a strawberry sorbet, and she recently had a pumpkin spice one that she did, and it was her first time trying it, and that one was bomb. Like, you guys should definitely check her out. Do y'all like the ice yes. cream? Yes, mm -hmm. it's oh, amazing, it's, it's delicious. It's, it's incredible. AJ, we need some more Cookie Monster. <laughs> that was mine, they ate it, so we need some more Cookie Monster. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I hope you like these you know, reviews of these local lovely treats. And I just wanted to like give them a shout out because most people don't know about some of the local goodies we have in the DFW area. Also, if you have a vegan business and you are local to the DFW area and you want us to review it for our local love, definitely hit us up and we'll be more than happy to try it out for you guys. I hope you liked this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, Stay tuned for more food and more treats and more reviews. And yeah, until next time, eat good. Eat vegan, don't eat that body, don't drink milk, don't do none of that stuff, because you don't need it, because we got soy-based ice cream, and we got other ice cream, and we got other treats, and we got vegan donuts that are bomb, that are local.